Okay, uh, welcome to another video of Hulkanasan. Today I'm going to tell you guys about uh, how to download MuseScore, which is the composing software that I use. It's one. It's the one I think the best composition software in the world, and it's also free. So you first put in MuseScore.com, and then when you go in, you'll see this page, where basically there's this download MuseScore button, press on it, and then you will get to a page which is MuseScore.org, and you can download, and I'll close that first, and then I will download it, and then when you download, you can choose three versions, if you're a window user, then you choose the window one, obviously, if you're a Mac, you can choose either the Mac one, or the beta version, and the better version is not that stable, so I would recommend the download for Mac. So now, you and you press download. You have to wait for it. Yep, okay. There. Oh yeah, there's also these apps that you can, like, see, and it will lead to a thank you for downloading MuseScore. And you would have to wait for five seconds. Yeah, four, three, two, one, and then download starts right there see this there's like the musicore 3 dot dmg which it, it 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 it's a it's a really good software that you can use to do whatever you like in it there's also percussion there is vocal there is brass there's string there is keyboard there's electronic there's all kinds of stuff so wait i have to delete these first and then now see there's this thing right over here and then when you see this, you go to your Finder if you're a Mac user. I'm not sure where you go. If you're a Google. Yep, so you open this one, drag it out. See this DMG? Right, so you have to double click on it. And then it will open you to a page where it's like, where it's verifying to know that it's like from an indent identified developer. So, basically, you have to wait and then it's gonna be okay in a few seconds okay there so now you see that there's this button you just drag it there and then you can close the tab you can delete the DMG I keep the DMGs just in case like something happens to the software I can download it again you can eject the MuseScore 3.3.4, and then you have to wait for its copying. It will take another few seconds. Okay, just give it a few more seconds, and then there, it's done. Now you can go to your Finder or your launch pad, I would go for the Finder place. Open Applications. There's also a Google Drive, which I just downloaded. Now there's MuseScore 3. You double click on it, and then there you go. You have MuseScore 3 on your desktop. It is, I believe, supposed to be given for higher than 10.10, .10, which is, I'm not sure. I think it's El Capitan, like, at the 10.10 .10 place. Now you can have this welcome to MuseScore, and then you can do Canto, but if you really want to learn like how to use it, then go for it. But then I, I will give to like the t tutorials about how to use MuseScore. So here you go, you can click cancel, you can click cancel, oh my god, or next. I would click cancel, cancel, since I already know how to use the software really well. I'm just showing you guys how to download it. So now you can delete this one, and then, yeah, so now you have new score, and congratulations. Remember to like and subscribe. See you next time.